Y'all need to run. Do not walk to the Marshall Clearance event. After you watch this video, of course, but you need to go. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Raven and I'm a fashion stylist and content creator. But on my channel, I do fashion hauls, fashion lookbooks, press on nail reviews, and travel. So in this video is going to be a fashion haul, honey, okay? I went to the Marshall's Clearance event. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. They got a bunch of stuff on sale at Marshall's right now, okay? I went into TJ Maxx first, saw some things on clearance, got a few things. It was what it was. So those things will also be included in this haul, but mainly... I went to Marshalls. I got a neighborhood Marshalls right around the corner, honey, about literally less than 10 minutes from my house. It's a problem. It's a problem. If you are a Maxanista slash Marshallanista, it's a problem to have a TJ Maxx home goods or Marshalls within 10 minutes from your house. This is a problem that I welcome with open arms. I want to share the amazing deals that I got on these clothes because I picked up some gems, in my opinion. I got some contemporary designer pieces. I even got some Zara, y'all. Like, what? Where they do that at? At the Marshalls? At the TJ Maxx? Okay? If you did not know, TJ Maxx and Marshalls now sell Zara. You're welcome, sis. It's not a ton of things, okay? I feel like I saw more things earlier this summer, but... They have it. I hope that they continue to stock more and more Zara items because your girl loves Zara. And I also love TJ Maxx and Marshall's pricing. It was at least, at least, I want to say like eight to 10 racks in Marshall's alone. Just the women's section, like the women and junior section or whatever. That was all like sale and clearance. Okay, they got a lot of stuff. So enough of me blabbering, let's get into this haul. So first up is this dress that I'm wearing. I got her from TJ Maxx. It was love at first sight with this dress, okay? I did get her in a medium. The way that I wanted her to fit was probably more on the large side. In context, I wear like a small, extra small in Zara pieces. So I wanted her to be a little oversized. So I thought the medium would work just fine. This is almost at bodycon status. So when I wash her, I'll probably be like stretching her out a lot just to get more of a shift dress type of feel. Anyways, I got her for $13. She was originally at the store for $16.99 and it says compare at $22. I don't even know if that's the compare at because you know, Zara and the dresses. And this is really good quality. So I don't think this was $22 at Zara. But you know, for TJ Maxx, let it be $22. That's fine. As long as I paid $13. Okay. As long as I paid $13, it can be compared to $22. I don't really care. But that's what it's compared to. Clearly, the tag in the dress says Zara. It did have the original like Zara tags on it. Next up is another Zara item. This top I got from TJ Maxx. I am obsessed with it, okay? I wish that I had gotten this in a small because your girl has big ribs. And according to the Zara sizing icons, which I just recently found out about, this runs small and it does, okay? It takes at least one extra person to help me get up into this. But when I'm in it, I'm in it, okay? But I saw her in Atlanta the first time when I was in TJ Maxx and loved her down, but left her at the store. Have regretted it ever since, okay? So when I was in the TJ Maxx and saw her on the rack, snatched immediately. I've seen what I needed to see immediately, yes, okay? This was... This was the only one, so it wasn't like there was a bunch of sizes that I could try and, you know, make work. But we got her an extra small. We're going to figure it out. Maybe I'll add an extra panel or something here on the side. I don't really know. But she's going to get worn. A lot. Okay? She's cute. 
Again, this came with the Zara tag. This time it was not cut off. This was originally $19.95. And in TJ Maxx, I got her on clearance. This thing has been marked down three times, okay? Because I see the stickers. This thing has been marked down three times. It is now $4. I got her for $4. Yes, ma'am, I did, okay? And to originally see her in June in Atlanta, and then miraculously she ends up on the rack in my TJ Maxx here in Dallas, Texas in August. It was fate, I had to get her. She don't fit that well, but I'm convinced she had to be mine. Next up is this skirt also from Zara. This one, I really like this print, it's fun. Again, a good little throw on and go moment, okay? It did just come with this tag and this was $7. It says compared to 25, this is probably like a TRF kind of piece maybe. So I can see how it could possibly be 25. Anyways, it was marked down from 19.99 at Marshalls for $7. This, y'all know the yellow tag means it's on clearance. So this thing got marked down a few times before the yellow tag was put on. This does seem like it's supposed to hit on the hips. <sighs> Raven is not a medium or low rise girl, okay? We do high waisted 99.9% .9 of the time, okay? So she's getting tied up so that this hole is not showing so that she can be a high waisted baddie moment, okay? But I just love this. Like the print is so fun. She is a moment. I'm in love with her. This is very like stretchy. It does come with like an elastic waistband for the back, honey. But it just seems like a very wide skirt for an extra small. So that's why we wear her up and tied up versus on our natural hips. But it is what it is. She's cute. Next up is this other denim top moment from Zara. Y'all. I snagged up almost every Zara piece that I saw in there, okay? Because they had some gems. Anyways, this top was $3 on the clearance, honey. On the clearance for $3. And it was originally $17.95 in the same currency as that striped shirt. Again, we'll find out what it is. This one isn't a small. This is cute. I love a little like jean on jean moment. I want to wear this with like some dark jeans. I can wear this with light jeans. I can wear this so many different ways. Okay, I can put this over like a white button up or I have this sheer shirt that I can put it over as well. I can do this over a turtleneck. I can do this a thousand and one different ways. Okay, like she's just not for the summer. She's an old season baddie. Okay, and I'm in love. But for $3 and the denim is nice. It has a stretch to it. It's a thick denim. $3, this is a moment. This is a moment for $3. And the back, which I love, has like a wide band so I can actually wear a bra with this if I want to. Nice little strapless moment, okay? Giving the girls a little bit more support because your girl is 38, not 37. 37, okay? Your girl is 37, so my chest is also 37. Um, so we need all the support we can get on most days. Moving on. Next up are these pants from Rachel Zoe. And I love these. Again, just a throw on and go moment. That's like the thread or the, what's this thing called? That's like the theme of this video. Throw on and go. I love a good throw on and go moment because we're not trying to be glam every single day, but we still have to be cute. So I love good throw on and go items. These were also on clearance. I got these for $10. Okay, they have been marked down several times and they did have a few of these, not a bunch, but a few. And these are in a size small. These are like harem pants. I love that I can tie the waist a little bit tighter because it's not the tightest thing on my waist. So we gotta always have a snatched waist, honey, even if it's throw on and go, gotta have a snatched waist. So snatching in that waist, I love that it has pockets, honey. We have pockets, you can't really put much in them, but I could probably put a cell phone Maybe a lip gloss or something. I could put a little something in there that's not in my purse. But these are great. I would wear these to like a festival. If I went to a festival, like an outdoor, outdoor, an outdoor, like 
there's like this outdoor food thing happening here in Dallas. This is where I'll probably wear these. You know what I'm saying? Just real cute, throwing a go with like a cute little crop top. <laughs> We're gonna be we gonna be out there. We're gonna be out there. These are cute. So the bottoms are like an elastic type of situation. They do have this tie. This tie don't mean nothing. Okay, not a thing. It is decoration. It does not cinch in the thing anymore. It is literally just tied on the side. Rachel Zoe. We we need functional pieces, okay? Because when I looked online. These, according to someone's Poshmark listing, honey, I don't know how accurate it is. These were originally $150. For $150, this need to be functional for $150. That don't even make no sense. Like, what? This need to be functional. This needs to be functional. But for $10, it can be non-functional. For $10, these are super cute. Just love them. Love them down. Moving on. Next, I saw this Nanette Lepore dress. I am obsessed with her. I do love a good, just kind of flowy moment as well. Okay, I do love a snatched waist, but I love a just like, I would wear her like traveling in the airport or whatever, nice cozy sweater. But this was super cute. This I think was also, nope, not on clearance, but it was on sale for $15. So when I looked this dress up online, she was 128. $15? Are we serious? Like, what? This does not have any, like, tags or anything in it. Whatever Nanette Laporte tag it had on it, I think it's gone. If not, it's not there. But I can see that it has the Nanette, Nanette, the Nanette, Nanette Lepore, um straps for the hangers inside. So that's why I knew which designer it was. But she's such a cute little moment. I might just have this as a house dress. We don't know. We don't know. We might also flip her because I can probably at least get double my money back off of her. So we'll see. We shall see. Lastly, we're going to talk about these two dresses together because they are the same dress, just in different colors. Okay? It is what it is. I saw them both and I snagged them up. Okay? I think I'm going to resell one of these because, again, your girl could probably get a pretty coin on these. I've already looked them up. And they're selling for way more than what I bought them. So these dresses are from Jason Wu. Okay, as soon as I saw the tag, I said, excuse me, in the Marshalls? In the Marshalls? We got the Jason Wu? In the Marshalls, we got Jason Wu. Okay, Jason Wu is very much a TJ Maxx brand. Okay, like TJ Maxx to me has the upper quality of the designers. But Marshalls? Marshalls is now getting them. Come on, Jason Wu. Anyways, this dress I got for $40. It was not marked down that much. It probably would have gotten marked down again and again and again. But I snagged her up when I did. So she does not have any more markdowns. And that's okay by me. Okay? But I got her for $40. She was at Marshall's for $49.99. $40. $10 off. That's totally fine with me. But when I looked at the original tag, which was untouched, okay, but on both dresses, MSRP, $248. I got her for $200 off plus, okay? And it was like tax-free because they had some kind of like tax-free weekend here in Texas this month. So it was tax-free. $40 for this dress. $40. Like, are we serious right now? I just love it. It is a size small. I could go for an extra small. If they had an extra small in there, she would have been snatched up along with these two to be sold, okay? But that extra small would have fit perfectly. But this is so cute. I love this. Again, throw on and go. You just throw this on, zip it up, and go. I put it on with these little flats from Walmart. Also love these down. Got them for like $3 her someone else got them for a dollar so go ahead over to the walmart and see if they still got them they may still have them online i'll link them in the description box of course but go and get you them sandals girl but this is super cute i this blue is hitting i may keep the blue and not the white i may keep both of them which i don't really know i don't really know but I love this blue. Like, it's such a deep blue. I don't have anything this color in, in this style of dress. 
I love a dress where you can tie the straps or like, yeah, the straps. Yes, I love a dress where you can tie the straps and really just get the bow as big or as small as you would like them. I love this. This color is gorgeous. You cannot tell me that this navy is not hitting, honey, okay? She is long. She is double lined. I can put her into like the fall as well with some cute boots. Can't tell me nothing in this dress. But I feel as though this one, and it's actually like a cream color. It's not a white. Between the three of these, I don't need all three of these dresses. You know what I'm saying? I just picked them up. I don't need all three of these dresses. I don't need all three of these dresses, okay? I'm the type of person, once the money is spent, it's spent, it ain't coming back, okay? So it just be like, it is what it is. They ain't gonna get returned. But I think I might sell one of these. I just gotta figure out which one. Cause I do want to sell it like with the tag on it. And yeah, but this is a good little moment. Both of these were $40. This is a well-made dress, okay? For $240, it's gotta be. It ain't giving no fake nothing. She is cute. I really like this. I have these boots from Zara. Go under this, give me a little Western vibe with a little hat. Y'all see it, y'all see the vision. I do love this like lace at the bottom too. This is a gorgeous dress, honey. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous dress. Like beautifully made. Jason Wu, you did that, honey. You did that. Did it. And did it again. Y'all have made it through the entire haul and I'm here for it. Thank you so much for watching this video. Like I said, go head on over to the Marshalls or the TJ Maxx and check out their summer clearance event. I might be going back. I might be going back because if they got some more Jason Wu, not necessarily the same dress, but if they have some more Jason Wu, your girl wants to get it. Wants to snag it up and get it. Mm, mm, mm. Yes, the prices are giving. You cannot beat these prices in the summer sale. So you might as well go on over there and see what they got because they got the stuff okay and since you have made it to the end of this video you might as well hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you're the first to be notified every time i post a new video and you might as well follow me on ig and tiktok so until next time y'all watch this video that was picked specifically for you